Italian manufacturer ERA will create a Challenger sedan to the Porsche Taycan. Era is a new name on the global and European EV startup scene, a company that wants to be perceived as classic, luxury and performance-oriented Italian company. The company hasn't built a vehicle yet, but has revealed its first model, an electric SUV similar in concept to the Lotus Elettra, and now we've learned more about its second model, a performance sedan with a similar design. Looking at the design of the SUV concept that Era has revealed, pictured in the gallery below, we can imagine what the sedan model will look like, although it will probably have different proportions, not just a lower version of the SUV. Back and forth every time, waiting for one of us to cross the line. You got me and I got you, and we got a lot to prove. They think we're too damaged to fix, but we're just working through. Autocar spoke with ERA design boss Filippo Perini at the launch of the electric SUV and he said that the sedan will be a concept on the road, in terms of its design, indicating that it will be more like a four-door supercar than a traditional sedan. The vehicle will apparently have an unusual door, although it is unlikely to follow the scissor-like design shown for the SUV model. Additionally, the vehicle will be designed to comfortably accommodate six people in the front and rear, which doesn't sound like a difficult task considering it will share the same 3-meter, 118-inch, wheelbase as an SUV, and measure approximately 5.1 meters, 200 inches, in total length. For reference, the Lucid Air sedan is slightly shorter in terms of wheelbase and overall length, but through clever packaging, it has ample space inside for even tall passengers sitting in the back. In terms of performance, the Air electric sedan will be one of the fastest in the world, with an output of 800 horsepower and all-wheel drive. It won't be as fast as the more powerful versions of the Lucid Air or Tesla Model S, and will offer similar performance to the revised Porsche Taycan, which is expected to produce horsepower, equaling or possibly even surpassing the Aero sedan in turbo and turbo S guises. Era plans to install a 120 kWh battery pack on the sedan, which will provide a Lucid Air equivalent range of up to 500 miles, 804 kilometers, on a single charge. With a starting price of 160,000 euros, 2.5 billion Indonesian rupees, the Era sedan is planned to start production six months after the SUV, which the company says will start rolling out in 2025. Deliveries will begin the following year and the goal is to build 25,000 units of each model. 
The two vehicles will apparently share 70% of their components in a bid to keep production costs lower. Era said that they currently employ 120 people, most of whom are involved in the design and engineering processes for the two new vehicles, but that the company has not made clear where exactly it will manufacture its vehicles. Production will most likely be outsourced to a company in Italy or close to Italy since that is where the company sources the carbon fiber to use in vehicle construction.